This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long, and now for the action. And a warm welcome from North London. We're at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone. And joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Gabriel plays alongside William Saliba in central defence. Declan Rice starts alongside Thomas Partey in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. The initial 11 for Wolves. Well, on paper, it's down as a 4-5-1. But for me, it's more likely to be a split midfield with three supporting the front man and two sitting that little bit deeper as defensive cover. And the match is underway. Martinelli. And now with Trossard. Wolves have it once again. Nelson Semedo. And here's Cunha. Lemina. Possession one. Martinelli Mateus Cunha effective work from Arsenal to regain possession oh splendid skill and the keeper more than equal to it So the corner played into the box and a goal not wasting much time today they strike first Wolves get us moving again. Certainly a swift response required after the setback. Good through ball. Encouraging move from Wolves. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Plenty of support here. 
foiling his opponent completely. And in the right position to read it. Mateus Cunha. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, it fizzled out. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Partey. Rice with it. Well, they're almost extending an invitation to have them come at them. Arsenal recovering possession well. An encouraging Arsenal move. Martinelli. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. An Arsenal corner as they look for more. It's a short one. Kai Havertz cutting the ball back. Oh, did so well to deny him. Danger averted for now. Well, that save just about keeps them in this, but they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Well, that's not watertight defending. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? Not out of the woods yet. Well, they can bring it out now. Declan Rice and return to Trossard really is a lovely example of how to pass the ball Thomas Partey Arsenal pushing forward with options available Rice and here's Martinelli oh genuine chance a smart stop here short corner nice looking move this what a commitment to defending another corner <laughs> who can he pick out well, did his job defensively Declan Rice Partey and return to Partey and there it breaks down but credit to the defence and a decent position for Wolves to be in but the danger averted for now Thomas Partey Bukayo Saka. Farsi. Martinelli. And play halted, free kick given.
Mateus Cunha. And Wolves losing possession. Declan Rice. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Ryan Ait Nuri. Lemina. Nelson Semedo. So half time, that will close the book on the first half here at the Emirates. Well, Declan Rice really coming out on top in terms of winning his duels in the first half. Your analysis? Well, he did most things right, didn't he? He certainly showed his quality in that first half. He played well, I thought. So the second half underway. Still plenty of time for Wolves to turn this around. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Now perhaps they can counter from here. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Trossard. A wilting under the pressure. Wonderful chance. And a penalty it is. Well, when you're behind in the game, you certainly don't want to be conceding spot kicks. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referee's got that right all round. It was a penalty and it was a yellow card. A chance to extend the lead. A goal! Calmly taken spot kick. Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. Wang Hee Chan. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Ben White. Trossard. And strong play here. It needs an accurate cross. Not a good pass. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Can they profit from this? Oh, my goodness. You've really got to praise the defending. That was top-notch. Thomas Partey. Saka. White. And a throw in for Arsenal. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Declan Rice. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Now, can they hit them on the counter? That's a good pass. And nearly a goal after that breathtaking move. Well, that was counter-attacking football at its very best. Unfortunately, they just couldn't finish it off.
Gabriel Martinelli. And Kai Havertz. A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So the game continues, and Arsenal cantering to victory now. Pablo Sarabia. Jürgen Strand Larsen. Now with Huang. Well, he's beaten his opponent. And his teammate got him out of trouble. Jorginho. Saka. Trossard. He's managed to lose his marker. A goal! And I'll tell you what. On this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Lemina. And that was a very fine read. Yuri and Timber. Gabriel Martinelli. Now in possession, Trossard. And the right place to cut out the pass. Trossard. Oh, he's put it just a fraction wide of the post. Well, there it is. Arsenal have created chance after chance, and I just can't see that changing. They've been excellent here. Jorginho. Martinelli. He takes aim. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Here's the replay, and as you can see, this is almost perfect. Lots of curl and enough pace on it. The keeper had no chance. Well, that's not a happy manager. He knows he's got a lot of work to do now. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Gonzalo Gedge. Pablo Sarabia. Opportunity here. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Now sending it in, and knocked out of there. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. Trossard. Marcinelli. And here's Rice. On to Jorginho. 
And credit due, a good intervention. Gonzalo Getz. It's looking promising. White. Well, in the dying embers of the game, but Arsenal still full of life, a most enjoyable performance. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. The electronic board has been hit. Can he put it away? Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, just look at this. He keeps his composure and he almost passes it into the back of the net. That's a very good goal. Well, it's an out and out pasting. 6 0. Mateus Cunha. Opportunity it is. And that's going to be the goalkeeper's ball. So the referee brings this match to an end. The final whistle is sounded and far from the ideal scoreline from the Wolves' point of view. Well, oh dear, Derek, that was a worrying display. They were completely outplayed in almost every department. The coach has got a lot of work to do before the next game. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, I have to say that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.